So we, what was even, what was that even? We had compliance meeting. a compliance meeting for athletes. So it was all the athletes, me too, athletes of the school in one like, I guess classroom. But we talked about drugs. Well, drug testing. <laughs> That's all I remember. And now we're just getting our books. It's the first day of classes and we look like a mess because we literally ran in the rain. We ran in the rain. We had to get to over there at like 620. The parking job. We were in a rush. Service vehicle parking only. Tarja run. Duncan acquired. <laughs> Hey loser. My stomach hurts. To the bookstore! To the bookstore. Maddie, how much did you spend? Her, mind you, her mom is a teacher, so she went crazy. Possibly maybe a hundred dollars. A hundred dollars. And afterwards she goes, I don't have Starbucks money right now. My stomach hurts. Oh my god, I'm sweating my badonk donk off. I'm there you go. So shh. These pens because they're erasable and I like to make mess ups. You like to make mess ups? Like I got these ones too. I love these pens because I saw them on TikTok and it looks like they look good. Pencils because I needed pencils. And I got these highlighters because I was like, I'm gonna need a highlighter. I got a pack of Piggly pens. They're the slack outfit. It was $30. Alright. And then you got notebooks. 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 How do you say croissant? Croissant. It's not croissant. 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 Crescent. Cres <laughs> coffee. I deal with coffee. 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 Don't uh it. Uh. Coffee. Coffee. Chocolate. Ch what? Chocolate. 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 Coffee. 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 Okay, we're here. Let's get books. Woo! Tay and Sal say hi to my vlog. Oh, hey. <laughs> None of us got our books because they're closed. I'm going to text you. Bye. Bye. So now it's just me. Obviously, I'm gonna try again to get my books because I need my books. Guys, I found Ryan. He said he had no classes with me, but he pulled through today. I was one of the late ones. We were, did you see how I many know. kids walked like, in? Wait. Happy day before I show you a day in my life of preseason. First week of college. Yay! Woo! College! 10 out of 10. Ex nope. 9 out of 10. Nope. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It was just difficult the first week because my schedule kept changing, but I was able to meet all my teachers, find all my classes, and make some friends along the way. <laughs> I guess you could say that I've just been trying to settle myself in and have a feel of how the semester is going to be like preseason with our schedule, how my schedule actually works, like how many classes I have a day and where to find those classes. I guess just adjusting to the college lifestyle. So anyway, thank you for clicking on this video. Before we start, I'd like to share a Bible verse with you guys. Here it is, here it is, and I'll just read it real quick. 
In case you haven't noticed yet, the background noise is very loud, which I apologize for. And I find myself saying these couple of verses way too quickly. So I'm just going to say it again nice and slowly so that you can actually hear it. Um, I'm reading 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verses 56 through 58. The sting of death is sin, and the power of sin is the law. But thanks be to God. He gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, my brothers and sisters, stand firm. Let nothing move you. Always give yourselves fully to the work of the Lord, because you know that your labor in the Lord is not in vain. So I chose that verse because I thought it related a lot to my situation. Now that I'm in college, there's a lot of freedom. And, you know, there are some trials and tribulations that may occur. But God always reassures me that all my work, my discerning when correct, is not in vain. But he does notice it and is proud of me, um, even if it's just like little decisions. And it's not anything crazy. It could be like deciding to sleep rather than being on my phone. Could mean self-care, could mean submitting assignments on time and studying. Still working on trying not to procrastinate as much because I know that's gonna bite me in the butt. I just know that as long as I try and stay rooted in the word as much as I can, he will lead the way for me. And to be totally honest, ever since I got to college, I haven't been very consistent in my Bible readings. This was actually the first time in like five days I picked up my Bible yet. And once I opened it, I was like immediately hooked. I read it for almost two hours and that in itself just shows that you were never ever too far away from god and that when you start opening your bible again when you start going to church again when you start praying to him again he will welcome you with open arms so yeah i think i'm gonna do some more homework um facetime a few friends because i need to check up on them and stuff they're starting school soon I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully I can get um, as much as I can. It varies every single day in my schedule. No two days are the same. Typically practice varies and I mean classes are the same. But yeah, usually my practice schedule varies, which means that my napping schedule varies. So I'm still trying to find a set schedule for myself, but I know that I'll figure it out soon enough. All right, see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Look who just came in, Vinalito. Um, I'm gonna go to my transitioning into university class and then I have a lab. Nice, in the same room? Uh, is it in the- Dickinson. Dickinson? Yeah. Who do you have? Uh, Jen Quirk. Me too, but after you. <laughs> okay, I'll-, I'll I'm with Allie, you. Miranda, and Brendan. I'm with Mackenzie from soccer and Ray. I just saw The Ray. laws. I just saw the laws. <laughs> I'm going. Peace. See you later. And here we are at my car. And it's not asking you about a lot. You're making YouTube? Yeah. Sometimes. Okay. I'm out of mind. What are we doing? Here, you, you, you get game on All right, guys. <laughs> Welcome to, uh, what's this class called again? Transitioning to university life. Right now, we're answering a couple questions, including how we react when we're stressed. Um, and how do you react when you're stressed? How do I react when I'm stressed? Uh, well, I wrote down on this paper, at first when we get overwhelmed and have many thoughts, but after the initial panic, we take a step back and breathe. That sounds. That sounds, sounds good. good. Um, when Emily is stressed, she cries. I cry. She yeah. cries. This is her paper. This is her answer for um when she's I'm stressed. Crying. I'm always crying. She was in the bathroom, so she missed like everything. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. I'm a soccer so player. So soccer superstar right here. <laughs> what position are you? Um, I play all over right now. I'm, I'm gonna back, left back, right back. All right. I'm gonna be supporting you all the way. Oh, fam. thank you. Of course, I'll be there for your games. Yeah. I got along all your positions. Okay. Got gotcha. you. Gotta drop. <laughs> drop your Instagram. Oh, Go it's uh, Mackenzie Barrett underscore. Mm -hmm. Two R's, two T's in my okay. last name. Okay. I peeped that. Okay. We're going to get rings this season. We're all getting rings this season. Ring season. <laughs> Here's my friend. Hey. Friend, would you like to introduce yourself? My name is Jose. I'm from Colombia. I'm 17. And oh. I'm a freshman. Oh, what sport do you play? I play volleyball. All right. I'm going to support you. Good night. And Thank then here's you. Grady. Go Knights. Okay. Men's volleyball. Nice, nice whip. Thanks. Go Knights. Come support Thanks. our games. Go Knights. I, I got you. All right. I'll see you guys. Right, Bye. Bye.
basically we just finished our group workout which only went for an hour and then now we're gonna play pickup here is a week of a night in september so this is kind of like our practice schedule seven days time 24 hours per day so this is the total hours of week every single person has and then minus four hours of basketball four hours of pickup 16 hours of class uh 10 hours of sleep a day eight hours of study hall eating social life therefore you have 24 hours and what will you do with this time to be successful this year yeah that's basically like if i were to give a schedule that's kind of my schedule except i don't always get 10 hours of sleep per day and i definitely don't eat for three hours a day because i tend to eat fast but um, everything else is pretty accurate anyway now we're gonna go play pickup i wasn't allowed to have my phone in the group workout but hopefully i get a little bit of the pickup wait Vlog. I was vlogging today. Oh. This is Devin, Hi. the homie. Miranda, I showed you already. Yeah, I know. But yeah. Guys, say, say hi to my vlog real quick. Say hi. 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 What's this? What's this one? I vlog. I have a YouTube channel. You can drop your Instagram or anything. Follow me. I can't. Yeah, you can. Follow me on Instagram. And I am Bill13. Yeah. <laughs> 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 guys. Hey guys, so just a little recap, we had group practice for just an hour and then we had pickup for about an hour and then I just took an ice bath. I'm gonna go back and try to eat as fast as I can before my next class, which is in like 40 minutes. See you guys then. just finished my classes Woohoo! yay it took us a minute to name our pig but well first of all we thought it was a boy but it's a girl and we named it kimberly aka kim aka kimmy so now i'm gonna go back to the dorm and finish up with some homework <laughs> what music are you playing what are you doing? <laughs> Can you hear it? What are you doing? Hope that doesn't get me copyrighted. Oh my god! Oh, you're you're right. Right. <laughs>